In this Prisma Cloud demo, we're going to take a look at some of the Cloud Security Posture Management, or CSPM, capabilities of the product. Before we get started, I just want to show how easy it is to onboard a cloud account. It's as simple as clicking Settings, Cloud Account, Add New, selecting the relevant cloud we want to onboard, choosing whether Prisma Cloud will monitor the security posture of the environment, or monitor and protect, which enables you to have Prisma Cloud automatically remediate misconfigurations as they are discovered. From there, it's as simple as adding your relevant cloud account details. And from there, Prisma Cloud begins building an inventory of all of the assets or resources deployed across your multi-cloud environment. You have a high level overview of all of the unique assets deployed across your multi-cloud environments, how many have passed relevant compliance standards, which we'll get to more in a minute. And then you can also see a trending view of as new assets or resources are deployed over time in your cloud environment, how many of them are passing or failing security standards that you place, as well as more granular details of every service name where we can click in to more details and see specifically how many unique assets of a particular service are deployed in the relevant cl clouds. Again, a trending view. As more assets are deployed, your cloud environment and adoption grows. How is their security status trending? As well as the specific resource types. Now, jumping over to the SecOps dashboard, this is where we can begin to see an overview of your cloud security posture. So from top instances by role, alert level by severity, policy violations and over time, to top internet connected resources, I'll get to this more in a minute, risk ranking by scanned accounts. Now this is pretty unique to Prisma Cloud because Prisma Cloud actually ingest data, not only from the cloud service providers, but from third-party vulnerability intelligence sources like Qualys or Tenable, the cloud service native providers like AWS GuardDuty, as well as Palo to network sources like Autofocus. It can actually build a deep contextual understanding of risk and then automatically risk rank every alert in your environment by level of severity. So security teams know exactly what are the most critical situations that demand immediate or most urgent attention. Additionally, we can show you globally everywhere that internet traffic is accessing your cloud accounts, as well as an overlay of known suspicious IPs with the specific ports or protocols that traffic is being accepted on. Now, on the topic of top internet connected resources, you know, it's interesting to see a database, for example, that has accepted traffic directly from the public internet. Now, this is not always a good situation. And one of the things that you'll notice about the Prisma Cloud UI is how actionable it is. By simply clicking into this particular database, you'll see Prisma Cloud populates the investigate tab of the product along with a network topology map showing the resource in question along with its relevant meta, along with its relevant product metadata, firewall or security group configurations. Prisma Cloud has surfaced this yellow exclamation point because it's saying, hey, there's something wrong or misconfigured about the resource. Not only that, Prisma Cloud is showing us that this resource has actually accepted traffic from these specific ports from a known suspicious IP address. Now, knowing that a resource is potentially misconfigured is very valuable information. Knowing that due to a misconfiguration, the resource is accepting traffic from a known suspicious IP address is even more valuable. But perhaps at this point, we want to know, well, how did this problem first get introduced into the environment to begin with? By clicking on the resource ID, we're able to dig a little bit deeper and Prisma Cloud brings up the audit trail where from the moment the resource was first deployed into your cloud environment and Prisma Cloud assessed the configuration of the resource, found some errors and proactively surfaced alerts to then every time the resource was updated, 
Prisma Cloud captures a diff of the changes and by whom. This enables you to go back to the very beginning of time of the resource and understand which developer or which user is making changes to that resource and any time a change is made that triggers additional alerts or security violations. Now, the investigate section within Prisma Cloud is one of the most valuable product uh, areas of the product because it enables you to ask nearly any configuration, event, or network question about your cloud environments in a cloud agnostic query language called RQL or resource query language. One of the most interesting queries that we can ask Prisma Cloud to surface is show me all resources deployed across my cloud environment that has that have accepted traffic from known suspicious IP addresses and have known host vulnerabilities. This is one of the most critical situations of your cloud environment. And you can see in just seconds, Prisma Cloud surfaces the relevant resources. Again, similar to the previous example, we can look at the specific resource metadata and we can click into the resource itself to learn more about how the issue was first introduced into the environment, what vulnerabilities specific CVEs were found of that particular resource. And we can look at these again in the findings tab as well, where Prisma Cloud has found a specific host vulnerability with this CVE and additional details about where it was sourced from, the severity of the CVE, et cetera. Now, one of the other powerful capabilities of the Investigate tab is to turn any RQL, any query that you make in Prisma Cloud into a cloud agnostic policy that spans your multi-cloud environments with a single click. Let's say you want to turn this hosts with known vulnerabilities query that I showed earlier into a cloud agnostic policy. By simply clicking create policy, we can do that. Now we give the policy a description, set the severity level of the policy, we can assign any relevant labels to the policy that we're creating. We can set this query. We can see that Prisma Cloud has already validated this query to be accurate. We can set any one of the compliance standards that Prisma Cloud ships with or any custom compliance standard to the particular policy we're building. We can set any relevant remediation steps as well. And that's how in just a few easy steps, you can turn any investigative RQL policy query into a specific cloud agnostic policy. Now, Prisma Cloud ships with out of the box with over 600 cloud policies categorized by audit event, configuration, network, and perhaps some of the most interesting policies are these anomaly-based policies which use machine learning. So for example, Prisma Cloud can surface alerts for unusual user activities or unusual port or protocol activities that might signal malicious insider activity, stolen or compromised credentials that traditional policies may not alert on. Now, one of the foundational components of any cloud security posture management tool is compliance. Prisma Cloud provides an overview of the compliance posture against any one of these compliance frameworks that ship out of the box within Prisma Cloud. Clicking into any one of them, for example, dives a little bit deeper into the details of how the cloud environment's compliance trend has fared over time, along with all of the unique assets or resources that are mapped to this compliance standard, how many have passed, how many have failed. And again, we can look specifically at the compliance requirement, the specific policies mapped to the requirement, the resources that have passed and failed these specific requirements. Creating an audit ready report against any one of the compliance frameworks can be achieved with a simple click. Just give it a name, what email address you want to send the compliance report to. You can set this to happen once or on a reoccurring schedule. 
And in just seconds, Prisma Cloud will generate a PDF compliance report that is ready to hand to an auditor. Now, within Prisma Cloud, you can either map compliance standards against any one of the out-of-the-box compliance frameworks that are fully supported within the product, or of course, by clicking add new, you can build any custom compliance standard for Prisma Cloud. Now, one of the last things that I wanna to touch on in the cloud security posture management capabilities within Prisma Cloud are the alerts. So while most users will configure Prisma Cloud to export alerts to an existing SIM, SOAR, ticketing, chat ops tooling, there are some capabilities to resolve and remediate alerts directly within Prisma Cloud. So let's take, for example, this particular policy, AWS security groups allowing internet traffic. Prisma Cloud provides a description of the policy, recommendations on how to address any violating resource. We can see here details on the alerts that have been triggered for resources that have violated this particular policy. And Prisma Cloud enables us to take a few actions here. We can either dismiss the alert, snooze the alert, come back to it later, or even remediate the alert, in which case Prisma Cloud will automatically generate the CLI command required to successfully ensure that this particular resource now adheres to this particular policy. As I was alluding to at the beginning of this demo, if you set Prisma Cloud to read write access, it can automatically execute this command for a continuously robust security posture. Finally, one of the last options that Prisma Cloud provides within its alerting capabilities is the ability to go in and investigate this alert, in which case it'll bring us back to the investigate tab of Prisma Cloud, where you can dig a little bit deeper to understand more about this particular alert. Now, this is just a high level overview of the specific cloud security posture management capabilities within Prisma Cloud. I highly encourage you to take a look at our compute demo for an in-depth look at some of the cloud workload protection capabilities that are also part of the Prisma Cloud cloud-native security platform.